Oh, what's going on, ladies and gentlemen? This is Demo Storm, and we're here on the Hunter, all of the wild. Um, today's gonna be a little bit more of an interesting video. I want to show you guys how to make an easy money. Um, some people have a lot of trouble doing the regular hunting thing, and I usually wouldn't do this, but I'll show you guys. It's kind of a glitch, kind of not, because you're using game mechanics to really. I, I call it tunneling. Um, basically, what we're gonna do is push a lot of the creatures or deer, mooses, bears, all the kind of like one part of the map, I'll show you guys right here is the end of a train tunnel. It's like a wall. And by using my ATV and coming like this, I'm pushing everything against that wall. And they kind of don't know how to escape other than to charge me or just run back and forth. So it, I could see it as being a game glitch, but I mean, it happens all around the world and you run into these by accident a lot too. If you're a runner or someone who runs around the map a lot, um, you kind of do this mostly on mountains, I noticed. If you run up the mountain, um, I believe it's Mount Leviathan. Yeah, right around here, you tunnel them. Like, they all come stampeding at you. Um, here is another spot. But this is just, like, one quick method for people who have the ATV. You can actually do it on foot, too. We did it by accident on foot, and that's how we kind of discovered it the other night. Um... But it, it, it does get you some easy money and doesn't have to put up with the, the whole hunting thing. But I mean, if you need money and need to level up your rifle fast, I guess it's a method. <laughs> I, I have no nothing against how people play games. You guys do what you want to do. Um, preferably, I wouldn't do this for myself, um, but I already had every rifle and everything by the time I came back and discovered this. So let's, uh, let's take it for a spin. So all I'm doing is just driving at that point. I'm gonna stop about 150 out, so my rifle is zeroed correctly. Let's see if it works, because I have been hunting this spot already. Quite a bit. And there it is, yep. And as you can see, downrange. They're all pushed up against a wall, just running back and forth. So I can get a little bit closer before all hell breaks loose. But they, they, they're they just pushed up against that wall. Um, it's now like a shooting game in a gallery. We got bears, we got mooses, we got deer. And some will escape, some won't. It's, it's bound to happen. But I mean, there is people who like just want to play the game for the hunt and not have to earn their items legitly. I mean, you could call this legitimately. <laughs> um, but you're not going to get any diamonds or anything doing it this method because they're all freaking out and stuff. You're not going to get that perfect shot every time. So you're about 132 out. You're about a 174. It's about the perfect range. And, you know, just kind of aim down the sights. This is my... Well, I probably shouldn't even use this rifle right now. There we go. 270. You know, I spotted some tracks earlier. <laughs> I love Close how it always is trying to teach you. I'll send the coordinates. Yes, it's like I've never played this game or have every rifle in the game. I just unlocked the funnel bow too. If you guys want to see bow videos, let me know. There goes our bear. Here's our big rifle. This guy's kind of loud. I kind of want the, the buck, that guy, right there to walk towards me. But, I mean, you can hunt the other way, too, <laughs> and do it right, but, you know, not a big deal. I, I think the devs should fix this, though. That's for sure. This is This is what the crazy AI does. <laughs> Like, it, it's insane that this happens so often. And this is what's happening out in the woods, too. Like, this isn't just up against walls. I see this happen, like, when you walk into a group or something. They just all start flipping out. That should have been fatal. Unsure, however. Yeah, they're going to run around. Probably bleed out. Oh. 
little bit too much right. That was flesh. Alright. Oh, he went down. Oh, no. Just limping all over the place. And eventually they will escape. It's weird. Alright. All right. They are quick. Not a f that was flesh as well, unfortunately. And that should have went through. Quite a few organs. Let's see. Is it over? Give it like half a second. All right, seems to be over. And you can do this here and here. It happens on both sides. This one's more deer. This one's more moose, elk. And deer. Bears. I've noticed deer more on the other side. So if you're looking to, you know, get down a couple of deer. That one works a little bit more interesting because it's not like the end of a map. You can literally go behind where it happens. So be careful. Uh, we get charged by deer when we go that way. But this is something I just kind of take new people on because they don't want to use the 243 for too long. Honestly, though, I love this game for, like, what it is. So... Don't really need this method as much. But yeah. As you can see, plenty of plenty of kills in one spot. Try and get him on highlighted. Want a nice screenshot. I don't know why. Wait for the highlighted. There we go. Let's see what we got. Moose, 100%. Any down the hill. Sometimes you'll find a lot of bodies just fell down the hill, but they all died on this side today. We got our mooses. Here's our big guy. As you can see, good amount of money. Quite quickly. And yeah. I mean, it got me EXP, it got me money. So if, if you're having some struggle fest trying to get that gun, or I don't know if, if bow might be hard. I don't know if they're going to stay there if you get too close. I have not actually pushed that. But I mean, you don't actually need an ATV either. You can walk here from here. So, in lowlands, raunchy, just kind of walk. Um, making noise helps. <laughs> it pulls more in. That's what I've noticed. That's why I use the ATV. The ATV is just a hundred meter range of just noise and scares everything. Let's go over here. And also just driving these tracks can get you a good amount of kills. Something just crossed on me. Like I find deer on the bridges recently more often than not. Um, there's a few other methods. I mean, if you're having a lot of trouble, like you're not seeing anything, you may have a glitched file as well. Um, that is something else I was reading up on. Thought I would give you guys those tips because I was having some days that I wasn't seeing anything. I'd go out, not find anything on some maps, and that's because your population file is not like rebuilding. It's, it's staying down. And I mean, if you're where I am in the game, which is level 36, um, you may have just destroyed your population. <laughs> and you can reset the file. I haven't done it yet, so don't, you know, you gotta do some research yourself. Don't just go around deleting files. It's never good. Even the devs said don't do that. But they said in, uh, some people said in the worst circumstances, that's the best thing to do is just reset your population file. That or I think you could probably, what, delete the full game and restart if you wanted to. <laughs> I don't think that's advised. 
So what I'm doing now is just kind of taking the trip down the railroad tracks. Let's see, I don't know what's if I can find anything real quick. There's tracks everywhere over here. I just never hunt in this part of the map. That's that's the biggest part here. It's, now that I'm doing it, it seems like I've seen way more. Never thought about checking this whole area. I stayed more in the top corners of the map, here and here. That's mostly elk and get to use my big gun, the 338. Uh, it's the final rifle that you unlock. But I actually have started bow hunting a little bit as well. And just unlocked the last bow. I mean, there's only two bows in the game. Three if you download the DLC for the better bow. But I mean, I just unlocked the final one. I just need to buy it. Which costs 46,000, so I mean, I could do this method a couple of times. I could play the game however I want. My hunter log. Where is it? Hold on. Yep, yep, yep. I wonder if it's still in here. No? Yeah, my top harvest was yesterday. As you can see, diamond rating on a blacktail male. Four medium? Or is it a five medium? I don't know. I have that picture. <laughs> it felt good. Um, it's my first diamond ever. So. Yeah, I got it on a nice blacktail. Alright, let's see if we can find anything on the tracks. If not, it's just a enjoyable ride. I mean, I, I enjoy this game thoroughly. I get things done quite quickly. Um, some days are not my day, though. I will say that. Some days I cannot aim for my life or don't see anything. Very unfortunate. Oop. Well, imagine not having an ATV and having to walk this. You're rough. Like I'm seeing anything out on these tracks today. It is a unique time. This is their kind of chill out time. So let's uh, I believe the time would be good for right here. I set up tents like in all good hunting spots of the map that I could think of. Some days I get really, really lucky. Just walk out of these tents and then. Like, Not seeing anything right now. Oh, there is something. Oh, there he is. Oh, man. Keep moving. Sorry, guys. Looking at my other monitor. All right, let's see. Non vital. A female still alive. Not for very long. I got a nice amount of hits on these guys. Down. Uh, I was running. 
won't be able to pull that shot off. Female went down. I hit that with two bullets. <laughs> yeah, running is never advised in this game, though. So bad. <laughs> it scares everything. There's our female. Is this our male? Yep. Right. I don't want to lose. Didn't mark her? Damn. I don't want to lose the one that was up here. This rain is. Oof. But yeah, if you guys are interested in some bow hunting, let me know. Um, it's a little bit slower. I can cut it up quite well. It doesn't take much, but I mean, it takes a lot of time to get the patience to even do bow hunting. Um, I feel like it's probably. I don't know. The hardest part of this game is bow hunting. Next to shotguns, I hate shotguns in this game. I carried I carried one around forever, just for situations that they would stampede me. But honestly, it just turned into I'm gonna track these tracks for about an hour. Eventually, it will go down. Looks like our male kind of just scrambled. Yeah, I should have put him down in one shot. I don't know what I'm doing. Sometimes you can't really fight the smells and things on the map. The cone down south, it just moves around too much, too. Um, I got scent eliminator and scent spray and everything. Even though they... Some people just never even touch that stuff, and they're better hunter than I'll ever be. Alright, he's down to 25 out of 50. You can see in the top right corner if you're trying to figure out what I'm talking about. Checking how much blood he has lost. And there he is. Oh, I wish I could see you. White tail male. But, overall, not bad. I mean, get to show you guys how to level up and get your, you know, money quickly. It's actually really quick. <laughs> you can kind of just keep redoing it. Um, there's a few other places on the map I've seen that work. There we go. And I have completed Hope's Quest. Which, also, good money. 38,000 now. What is Hope's new mission? Kill white-tailed deer down within 45 meters of me. Oh, great. That's always a good time. In raunchy heights. Nice. Okay. That would be that part of the map if I wanted to do a quest. But I'm going to end here, guys. Thank you guys for joining me for today's episode. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And let me know what you want to see in this game. I've been Emil. Have a wonderful day.